Assalamu alaikum. Hi everyone, this is Mr. Ayman, ICT teacher. Uh, in this video, we are going to uh, explain how to uh, deal with the style sheet, how to add the table and the TDN style sheet, how to differentiate between the internal grid lines and external grid lines, and also we are going to add how to do the collapse of the table, how to make table collapse within the front page. Uh, first of all, you must have the front page already installed in your computer. If you don't have it, I give you the link below this video. Uh, remember to press uh, like and share and subscribe. Right. Now I begin. The question here asks: A trainee has started to create a single style sheet to be used uh, with the website. The style sheet was not finished and contains number of errors. In this scenario. You have two options other than you open the style sheet first of all you decide to remove the contents in the style sheet uh, here we have the difference between again, internal deadlines sheet and from the beginning deadlines. it depends on the question internal grid lines which I'm means to you how to the inside the style sheet code inside the style sheet code is in the style sheet uh, file as td uh, you have to the and external grid lines before you begin we uh, are here we have the difference the, between uh, internal grid lines outside external grid lines now is the internal grid lines which means the inside the external code is in now we have to find as a for the rest of the table for the black color and grid lines we are the red color border the star sheet we need them for the city now we want to use the black color Yes, this we call the statement, for example, we call it as nine, nine, table. Nine. Now we have to, let's do the start uh, uh, the beginning one is the table, table with the black, black color, color. Examiner with the and the TD have. with the red we color. We decide to of create a new style sheet uh, because for we're going to use this later on. If you check the question, if you check the next question, we ask you to analyze or to evaluate the contents of the style sheet done by the, uh, by the trainee. Right. Uh, we're going to go this now. Style sheet, close it. You're gonna do this. Go to uh, remember, click on the file, new. From this window, use uh, more page templates. And then here, remember to go to style sheet. First one, you don't have to select it, already selected by default. And then, okay. Now we have a new style sheet. Advise you to save this style sheet from the beginning. Uh, it's names 161631s, you followed by your candidate number. And again, I click and save. Uh, don't remove the CSS. Advise do not remove it. Same name. Now follow it by your candidate number, example 9999. And then save. Now we are going to add the selector into the style sheet. As he said the question, return back again. He said that table and he said that external and uh, internal and external. He said that external will be two pixel things, grid lines, and internal will be one pixel things. Let's do the external normally. Now we're going to add the external by adding, uh, click on the format. Click on the format and then style. Go to table. Find the table. Yeah, just double click on the table. Format. And then go to border. And then the width. Let's check the question again. He said external will be two. Yes. So the width will be two. You just put the two. No. You don't have to add anything in the paddings here. Keep all of them empty and salt will be selected automatically. And then okay, and then okay, and then okay, let's check. Yes, now table has been added here, but there is something else very important. Uh, examiner will never ask you something regarding to the internal. He said the external is the table. He mean by table is external. But internal is the TD. There is a selector whose name is TD. We have to add the TD and then TD will give him grid lines one pixel. Uh, what is the TD? Let's go ahead a little bit out and explain what we mean by TD. Uh, here we have the difference between internal deadlines and external deadlines. 
internal grid lines, which means TD inside the uh, code, inside the style sheet code, it should be uh, signed as TD, as a selector, as an ED. And external grid lines should be as the, the, uh, the border outside. Uh, now displays in a black color. Yes, this we call it the external. We call it as table. Now we have two. Now uh, the first one is the table with the black color, and the TD with the red color. I hope this uh, done for the TD and table. Uh, how to add back to the front page again? One more time to the front page, and then table. Uh, format again, style, and then return back the list to the HTML tag, and then find the TD below the table. Double click on the TD, and then same things, border on the TD, and the within the TD, we set one pixel. So get it, it should be one pixel on the TD, so it's one. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, okay. Now, very good, done. Okay, there is something very important here. Uh, within the question, he said that all borders collapsed. All borders collapsed. This kind of code not uh, not offered by uh, Microsoft front page here because if you click on the style, format and style, if you try to style in the table with the format border, there is no collapse here could be done. Collapse cannot be done from here. Uh, collapse, uh, we can write collapse by ourselves normally inside. Are we going to write the collapse within the table here? Do we see comma normal? Like the other one. Yes, we, you have to write it. Now we have to yes, see comma. Now, border collapse and then border dash not underscore collapse dot collapse you have to make a little bit space here and you don't have to do sim comma again because this is at the end of the table uh, here we have the border border is collapse now done check it with the question yes then let's check the question again back then let's continue the questions uh, Thank you very much. We're going to continue the past paper later on. Next video, we're going to continue the rest of the past paper. I'm just uh, touching the difficult things that should be done. Uh, you can continue doing this uh, on your computer. You can send to me if you have any questions. Thank you very much.